Indian temple, 500 steel goals, three Chinese temples, you know for their material arts, the Shaolin temple, for the most famous. The monks there practice a spread from a kung fu. Shaolin's leader, Tian Yuan, trains the hardest, was strong, patent, and wise. Also, all the monks love to practice with him. He makes sure to teach each opponent a new skills. Everyone in Shaolin knew he was the best. One day, the head of the Chinese army was the Shaolin. He spoke to Tian Yuan, Paris are attack attacking Tina. The general says, I want you to lead the three temples into a battle against them. Tian Yuan screams, We will transfer, he says. Three men from the other temples travel to Shaolin. However, some of the monks were jealous. Why should the Shaolin get all the glories? Shilin says, Our temple is just as good as Shaolin's. The other monks breathe. We shall be leading the army. One says, Shilin convinces each man to challenge Tian Yunan. One day, the sun drowned in the courtyard of the Shaolin temple. It says in any warrior, he who is more suited to this earth. Tian Yuan says, I will gladly bow to him. Three men attacked Tian Yunan as one of the three monks were ready. With his quick hands, Tian Yunan knocked out three men. You must be practiced. Tian Yunan says, Let your office come to you. Next three monks tries to run us. Tian Yunan from different angles. Tian Yunan go too fast. He jumped high into the air. The three monks ran into each other. You must know where your friends are at all times, as well as your enemies, he, he says. Get him, she didn't yell. Choose your monks, they what? Tian Yunan cups their first in his hand. He held them so tightly they couldn't move. Strength is as much in the mind as in the body. He pushed. The monk went flying. Three were hung from the temple walls. Shirin Lai ran to take them down. He passes them to the other monk. Get up! Shilin yells. He just one man. Attack! The monk attacked from eight sides. Tian Yunan attacked quickly. He grabbed a long pole from the door of the temple. He scraped it in a wide circle. All the monks fell to the ground. One squad plants it better than eight bad ones. Tian Yunan says, Tian Yunan held out his hand to Shilin. You are not yeah, my enemy, Tian Yunan yeah, says. Yeah. If you let me, I will teach you the true art of Kung Fu and the series of Shaolin Temple. We can defend our land together. The three temples train for ten days and ten nights. With Tian Yunan's good dance, the Shodia learns to be a party, strong and wise. The pirates attack on the eleventh days. They were released, but no much for the monks. The monks easily defeat the pirates. The pirates sail away and never return. After the battles and monks return to the temple, the monks bow before Tyrannis. We shall not have stopped you, Shilin says. You are a true Kung Fu master. Tyrannis yeah, trained the monks for many more years. Together, they became the most real warriors in all of China. As Think about it. Out of all the monks in China, when we see on the vessels, how are the monks able to defeat the pirates so easily? What lesson does Shilin learn in the story?